Hey everybody, it's Crappy the Craps Man here, Regression Obsession. Welcome to the channel. Well, this is day three. Actually, I did one this morning. I'm doing one in the afternoon. Uh, of the, I saw it on Anything Craps. The guy that he puts up 6400 across. Pays his vigs on the 10 and 4, so 6500 bucks. One hit and leaves. Well, we're at day two. I'm just thinking, well, we've already made half the money it takes to recover. I'm worried about the recovery mode, you know, of doing something as crazy as this. But, I mean, you could get lucky and it could work every day and you could be making big money every day. I don't know. But anyway, I was thinking of a way. How many times do you see four sevens in a row? It happens. Maybe one, two times a day on a table at the most. Uh... Three sevens, more common. Two sevens, pretty common. Um, in the essence of time, I'm going to do three sevens. So when I see two sevens, that's when I'm going to lay it out. But what are you going to do in the meanwhile? You ain't just going to stand there and buy in. I'm buying in for 6500 and then I'm going to stand there and wait for all those sevens. So you got to keep busy doing something. Here's our profit so far in day two, $3,350. <coughs> I'm going to take a couple hundred bucks in red. That'd be a hundred bucks to fill up a full rack here. So I'm going to fill up two racks of red. Just to be playing there. But you're gonna, they're going to look at you funny when you buy in for 6000 something. And you only... Uh... So anyway, that leaves us... This, we're going to use that 200 right there to play some stuff. While we're waiting on this 7s to happen. Okay, so this is our profit over here. This is our original 6,500. As soon as we see those sevens, we're gonna lay it out. I don't know if it'll work or not. Um, I'm skeptical of the whole thing. That's why I kind of started this little little venture. What are we gonna play? All right, we'll say it's a $10 table with a $10,000 limit, which is, uh, there's a lot, that's what it is at Cherokee anyway. Let's play an ATS bet. Five and five, okay. And we'll do a ten dollar pass line bet. We'll put some odds on that. That's all we're gonna do. Waiting on those sevens, okay. Now here's the funny thing. Before I haven't even been worried about the point. If I roll this right now, we would have hit it. Let's see what I would have got. I did not lay my bets out there. If you watch the oh, there's a seven. See, that would have been the end to the bankroll right there. All right. So we're going to lose these guys. I'm going to rebuy them. But we're going to get paid right here. Ha <laughs> I dodged, crappy dodged a bullet with his new idea here. Because that would have been done deal. All right, let's see if we get a point. That's one seven. All right. There's a five. That's a point. All right, on the five, I'm going to lay some odds out here. Oh, I need to start marking my shots too. I'll take these white chips for that. So we hit a five. And the way this is going to pay, same thing at Cherokee. It pays 30 to one here, 150 to one here. So you get 750 for that one. Uh, it varies. Different casinos are different ways. Some of them are 80 and 100 and 75. But 150 to one is what I, my table pays. All right. Let's lay some odds here. That pays... Uh, We'll put uh, 40 bucks in odds on that. And let's see if we can hit it. So these are all our odds. Here we go. There's a five. We smoked it right out of the gate. I'll mark that just to see how many we can get. Okay. It'll pay us one to one here. Three to two for those two. And three for two for these two. Pretty good little rake right there, guys. Look at that. All right. That's pretty sweet. All right, we're coming out. We're waiting on two sevens in a row, and then we're going to place all our money up there. All right, eight is our point. Mark our eight. 
And no, I'm not really into, there's a four. I didn't place my um, odds here. So on the eight pays uh, six for five. So I'll put 50 bucks in odds up there. So these are our odds right here. Stack them up there. All right, we get another five. There's a seven out. We'll lose this. And to reset all this, we're going to repay. And we are coming out again. Waiting on two sevens, and then we're going to place our bet. All right, there's a midnight. That's good. Get that out of the way. I'm going to come out. Oop, I didn't have my pass line bet up there. So I'm going to lose it because I'm going to go back on the pass line. Some casinos make you play the pass line if you, uh, and I'll keep testing them on that one, but they make you play the pass line because I'm not normally a pass line player to play these uh, prop bets. But they'll say, oh, you got to play the pass line. And then the next dealer comes up, I uh, won't play the pass line. I'll throw them that and they'll put me on there. So I just, tell each one's, I think they just try to get you to play the pass line. That's probably their job. We hit two 12s in a row. It's going to cost us 10 bucks again. All right, we hit an eight. That's our point. All right, what am I going to do on that eight? I'm going to do $50 in odds. 40, 50. $50 in odds. All right, here we go. We got a six. We got a 10. We got a crafts three. We're hitting these lower numbers. That's good for this ATS. We got a five. Come on, we need a 9 or 11. We got an 8, and that is our point. I'll mark them twice just to see how many rolls I get. All right, the 8 was our point, so that's going to pay us 1 to 1 here, and you're going to pay us 60 bucks here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Pays us 6 for 5. Just like that, we are back in business. All right, we are coming out. Let's see what we can get. We hit a seven on the come out. <clears throat> it's gonna pay us here. We're gonna lose these guys. So I'm gonna have to pay them. All this is gonna reset. And that's one seven. One seven right there. Let's see if we can get another one. And we can put our bets out there. Oops, let me pull this 10 down. Oop, I'm gonna go to the eight. We still playing. This might take a while. I'll put 50 bucks up there in odds. And we hit the eight. And we hit the eight. Look at that. We're not getting too far ahead on our deal here yet. But Ten. Yeah, we are actually. Forty, fifty, sixty. Make a little money waiting on our setup to happen here. All right, we're coming out. There is a five, that's our new point. That five pays three to two. So I'll put 40 in odds up there. Oop, we gotta mark my five. And there is a seven out. So 
it's like every time we get ahead, we lose that. All right, we're going to pay 15 bucks here again on our ATS bet. And that's our small, our tall, our all, and our tall over here. All right, going back out on the pass line. We're still, there's one seven we hit. If we hit another one, we're going to go all the way across. All right, there's a four. We didn't hit it. Okay, four pays. So we'll just put 20 bucks in odds on the four. Okay. And we are going to mark the four. Let's see how she goes here. There's a nine. There's some snake eyes. Helps us out on that small. There is a midnight. We are on the other side. There is a six. There is another midnight. And there is the seven out. Don't lose all these. Don't lose all this. So it cost us 15 bucks. So, so far in our bankroll on our 200 we took out, we're just kind of smoking around even. Ten dollars. Did I pay that already? It don't matter. I'll pay for that. I think I already did. It don't matter. It's only fifteen bucks. We'll we'll make up for it. All right. I'd rather pay for it than not. Coming out. There's one seven. Oh, did we hit a seven before? Yes, we did. That's our second seven in a row. All right. We're going to lose, let me settle up all this stuff first. We're going to lose right here. So I have to re-up that, but we're going to get paid right here. Now that's our, our second seven. I was thinking about three, but I'm going to do it. Here we go. The moment we've been waiting for. One hit, and we are going to go home. And here's our $100 in bigs. Which if we don't hit the 10 or the 4, we get it back. So I'll just set it right there. Alright, here's our roll. We don't want a 7. This would be three sevens in a row. Coming out, but we're working. Here we go. Bets are on. Woo! Here she goes. We get an 8. Look at that. Mark the eight, and we're going here. We might play this hand out, but let's get paid, buddy. We're going to get paid fourteen hundred. We are going to get our hundred back because we're going to pull our bets down. Say, dealer, take me down. Look at that. And just like that, we gained money back again. All right, we are on our thing there. Let's go ahead and roll, finish this roll out. Put 50 in odds. Yep. Maybe we we'll hit that ATS. Snake eyes. Five fever five. Six. There's a nine. Look at that. We hit all the insides. We need that four and three right there. There's another six. An eight wouldn't hurt my feelings. And there's a seven out. All right, we're paying the ATSs and the pass line deal and all that. We lost exactly a hundred bucks on that. I think we would have been up just doing the pass line. But 
here's our original 65 from the original and on video number three where we stand four thousand five hundred four thousand five hundred and fifty dollars up <coughs> actually forty six hundred and fifty because we still got this hundred left not too bad I'm gonna keep this going I'm gonna try that so after two sevens I'm gonna lay it out there and go for the next roll and really in reality if you could sit around and wait for three but what I don't know what kind of people put that kind of money up there on one roll but not me but it's fun to do and I got the idea from anything craps and if you haven't joined anything craps you guys should check it out on Facebook a bunch of good people on there we have a lot of good conversations and if you have any questions you can ask them people lots of lots of people you're gonna know are gonna be on there if you watch a lot of YouTube stuff but anyway y'all don't crap out.